although the body can generate billions of different kinds of antibodies, antibodies which respond to different antigens, and millions of different T cell receptors. Our genome does not possess billions and millions of genes for these proteins. Instead, the genes for antibodies and T cell receptors have a number of small blocks which code for the pieces of antibodies and T cell receptors. And these pieces can then be joined at random. And so therefore there are a number of alternate possibilities for a specific spot on an antibody molecule. And which one is inserted is a random assortment. And so because there are so many different gene sections, this produces enormous possible combinations if these different sections are joined in different ways. This is how the body generates such a diversity of antibodies and T-cell receptors.